I'm here, one, I'm here with Rick Lazio. He's check running one, governor check of the Defiant two, State. Check one. And he's check helping two, with the uh, terror one, trial protest. Check two. What are your thoughts about check that? Check one. I'm check really two. Outraged by the decision to check bring, one. Uh, check two. Check one. Check two. Two. Was good enough during the check one. Two. One. Two. Prosecute those cases. One. The idea of giving the mastermind of the plot to take down America, take down New York, kill thousands of innocent civilians give him a platform to be able to spew their hate and to build a bigger platform is an outrage to me. It's not going to happen if good people come out. Some people thought this would be a one-day story. It's not going to be a one-day story. People are fired up. They're angry. They're frustrated with the government's decision. It's not going to happen. It's not happening today. It's not happening next year. It's not happening ever. And you're going to see that people are going to come from, I see people here from all parts of the Northeast that come in, up to people from Pennsylvania and Syracuse, who really feel the betrayal like the decision to hold a civil trial for somebody who is as evil as this person and who is an enemy combatant it's a fundamental podium podium check one two one what a, what a military tribunal is check one to check two two i agree now how about the fact that we still have a hole in the ground over there it's it's, it's another outrage honestly you know we talked about this before about how in the middle of the depression it was a, a dedicated band of construction workers. New York wanted to prove that it could create jobs, that it could restore pride, and put the shovel in the ground. And 410 days later, the largest building in the world was built. They called it the Empire State Building. You look at the, the, the hole in 9-11, it's a hole in our heart. We need to get cranes back there. We need to get that building up. We need to get the people back to work. We need economic activity. We need to show these terrorists that America is strong, they never back off. It is always growing, always moving ahead. We've got strength because we've got the spirit with us, we've got the heart with us, and we've got a great system of government. We just need to clear barriers and get positive and not take no for an answer. I think we can whip up that unity that we had almost a decade ago. I agree. I agree. And also, sir, I want to wish you well. Thank you very much. I'm honored to have you. Thank you, Mr. Lazio. Thank you. Thank you, guys.